Joe Zarzer here with a, another uh, update or discussion on the Florida's Wrongful Death Act and cases that come from Florida's Wrongful Death Act. They're, they're called wrongful death cases. Wrongful death cases can be based on any kind of negligence. It can be a death in a hospital from medical malpractice or nursing malpractice. It can be a death in, on a jet ski as a result of somebody's negligence on the waterways. It can be a death in a vehicle as a result of somebody's negligence on the road. Uh, so wrongful death is a type of personal injury case that addresses the situation where the person not only is injured from the event, but they also die. And one of the first questions that has to be looked at is, is the case even able to be brought or has the statute of limitations in Florida expired? The statute of limitations in Florida for wrongful death cases is two years. The statute of limitations in Florida for a case where somebody's injured but doesn't die is four years. So obviously there's a big difference. You only have half the time to investigate and pursue a wrongful death case that you would have in, an other, in any other kind of injury case in Florida. So it's important that you hire a lawyer quickly after a, a potential a wrongful death case uh, or after somebody has died because you have a lot less time to do the investigation, figure out the legal theories, and bring them. The other thing that's important is that if the, the or if the wrongful death did come as a result of medical malpractice, Florida has a pre-suit statute that must be complied with before you bring the, the case. So you as the plaintiff in the case uh, of a medical malpractice wrongful death case would have to investigate and do the pre-suit process through your lawyer before you can even file the wrongful death case. So you have uh, that process generally takes six to eight months. So you really have less than two years to bring a medical malpractice wrongful death case because you have to deal with that pre-suit process. So if you have a wrongful death situation and you're thinking about whether or not to get legal advice, you should not delay because there is only a finite amount of time to bring the case. And it's really important that you comply, obviously, with the statute of limitations because if you don't, there is no exception to that rule. Your case is gone forever and no lawyer can fix that, okay? The other thing that's important to understand is like, like we've discussed in other videos on wrongful death, the only proper party that can bring a wrongful death case is the personal representative. Well, if you wait to the last minute um, to bring your wrongful death case and your two year limitation is coming up, you cannot file that lawsuit unless there has been a personal representative nominated by the probate court. So that process has to be completed before you can bring the case. If you were to bring the case in the name of somebody that wasn't the personal representative, that case could be dismissed because it's not been, it has not been brought by the party that has the authority to bring the claim. So there's so many things that are going on with the probate situation in addition to the other things that you have to uh, make sure you uh, take care of in a wrongful death case that you should not, again, waste any time seeking out legal counsel for your potential Florida wrongful death case. If you have questions about Florida's wrongful death statute of limitations or Florida wrongful death cases in general, you can find us on the web at zarzerlaw.com or you can call us at 855-HIRE-JOE.